Today we're going to take a look at the Griot's Garage Foaming Cannon for vehicles or RVs. You connect this foaming cannon sprayer to your pressure washer and it'll give your car or RV a nice foam wash. The foaming cannon will release your car shampoo in a nice thick foam lather that clings to the vehicle to help loosen and remove any dirt and grime. Basically you just spray the solution onto your vehicle and it'll trap the contaminants inside the foamy lather and then the gentle foam will rinse clean away without any aggressive scrubbing needed so you don't have to worry about accidentally scratching your paint while washing your car. This cannon here is a new improved design that features stainless steel inside and out, has a stainless steel manifold with stainless steel internals and even the barrel was upgraded from nylon com composite to a full stainless billet. And what's nice is the stainless steel internals will help resist chemical induced corrosion that can cause problems on a standard brass manifold design type, type of washer. Now this will offer two types of detergent dispensing methods are available for this. The manual mix yeah. method will dispense a pre-mixed ready to use foaming solution. Basically what you'll do is pre-mix a foaming concentrate prior to use. Normally you'll do one and a half to two ounces of concentrate to 32 ounces of water. Put it in this reservoir and then you're all ready to go. The other method you can use is the auto mix method. And what this does is this will automatically mix the concentrate for you using the included appropriate metering tip that you choose. Gives you three choices of metering tips and they are color coded. So the pink tip right here is for a gas powered pressure washer, which would be about 2200 to 4000 PSI. Use the purple tip if you're using an electric washer, which is probably 1100 to 2200 PSI. And the aqua tip you can use on either pressure washer for maximum foam. Basically what you do is take the tip you want to use, put it into this stainless steel pickup ball right here. Fill your reservoir tank with your car shampoo, drop it in there, and then you're all ready to go. You attach your pressure washer's nozzle to the foaming cannon with the reservoir attached. Turn on your pressure washer and your solution will spray in a gentle foaming lather. Now you can also adjust how much shampoo you're using by turning this regulator knob right up here at the top of the cannon. If you turn the knob clockwise, it'll set the cannon to consume more shampoo, which is great for removing heavier grime. Basically, when you're done spraying the shampoo, turn the regulator knob counterclockwise until only water is sprayed then the, from the can and then you can rinse down the vehicle. And you can actually even adjust the fan nozzle right here. It changes the width of the spraying foam. The cannon's nozzle will adjust to produce a nice wide spray pattern of up to 40 degrees for efficient coverage or you can adjust it to a narrow zero degree stream for a long range dispensing on like car roofs, trucks or RVs. And as you turn that it will change the pattern does give you this large 33.8 ounce reservoir which will hold enough solution for cleaning multiple vehicles without the need to refill. does have a one-way vented cap right here, reservoir cap that won't leak while you spray. And what's nice is you'll notice, let me take this reservoir off, it is double threaded. You can see it has double threads on it and that's to accept Rio's other bottle sizes of 22 ounce or 35 ounce bottles. I happen to pull one of their 35 ounce bottles and you can see by taking the cap off dropping the ball in it'll screw right into the internal threads just like that so the double threaded cap will accept different sizes different bottles it's very simple to use all you have to do is just connect your pressure washer add your solution spray and rinse it is compatible with most pressure washers now if you are not satisfied with the foam output that you're getting you might be using a lower pressure electric washer that has less than 2200 PSI. They even take care of that. They offer, they include this uh, secondary foam cannon manifold jet that has a smaller 1.1 millimeter orifice, orf, orifice that can be changed out and increase your foam output. Basically all you do is right here, just unscrew the one that's already in there. The one in there is about a 1.25 mill, millimeter orifice unscrew that out with a screwdriver, put that one in there, and then it should give you the fo foam that you'd be looking for. Also includes the stainless steel quick to disconnect coupler to quick connect to your washer hose. That'll screw right in here behind the orifice. This part is made in the USA. Specs on this, minimum pressure this will accept is 1100 PSI, maximum pressure is 4000 PSI, and it does come with a nice manual and care instruction booklet. But that should do it for the review on the Griot's Garage Foaming Cannon for Vehicles and RVs.